Hi Leo, it's Elle here to do your February 16th through the 22nd general weekly reading. Uh, it is a general reading. It will not resonate with every Leo, but if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. All right, so Leo, this week, um, I don't know, it looks like a lot of doors finally getting the closure that you need. There might have been a breakdown in communication in a marriage or, yeah, in a marriage or some, you know, committed dynamic. Um, someone is forgiving you. So it's either a breakdown where someone doesn't want the relationship anymore or someone is forgiving you or vice versa. You're forgiving someone else, but you're asking for time to heal, asking for time to get over asking for time to be in that uh state of wanting to forgive or to move past because there was a breakdown in communication here also um it says that it's going to be an end to a difficult relationship situation um someone's playing ball someone's getting in line here um it, they're asking you the cards this week are asking you to forgive and release the harsh judgment that you have in regards to a particular person. Uh, things didn't turn out your way for some of you, but uh, someone is still willing to forgive. But it's still going to take time. Okay? The advice here for you is to be grateful for what you have. The, the air of gratefulness. Uh, if you have the family, if you have the home, be grateful. Speak your truth about what it is you want to see to see happen um be honest about how it, it will be a challenge for you to get over either what this person has done or you have done to another person um and it is still it's still up in the air for some of you it's still a decision that you have to make and you have to do some soul searching in regards to um reestablishing uh, coming, somebody's confused about if they should just stay or walk away. Um, the outcome to this week might be someone desiring to walk away to find something more meaningful, fulfilling. Somebody feels like someone is superficial, out of line, out of order. Um, did something out of line or out of order. Not true, not truthful. Uh, they feel like it's just too much of a headache to start over, to to start again. It's, it's someone's going to come out of uh, the confusion of this the situation. So either you, Leo, or a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, someone is forgiving you, but they don't want the relationship back, right? Or vice versa, you know, you're forgiving someone, but you don't want the relationship back. Some of you did not practice an air of, gra you know, grat gratitude and being grateful for what it is you had in a particular person. Um, now it is that you guys don't see eye to eye. It's conflicting and confusing uh, motives and objectives. Uh, some of yeah, now it's and it's too many people in in the fight in the argument. This could be Leo. Someone you guys are arguing too many petty arguments though. Where are we going for dinner? And then it snowballs into an argument. Where'd you put the cast iron skillet? And then it turns into an argument. Too much pettiness over over home shit. Over like like stupid stuff in the home, or not cleaning up, or cleaning after yourself, or someone. Or yeah, someone definitely. They're gonna have a change of journey here, a change of home. Um, they're finding balance in the fact that let's see. Some of you are going to reestablish something with someone. This is someone new, though. Or someone, yeah. Okay, so. Some of you want to go back to a past person situation. It was more uh, emotionally fulfilling for some of you, is, is what you're saying. It's too much drama with a, a right now person. Um, your wife or your husband. It's too much drama here someone is keeping options open someone is wanting to 
start something new. Is this somebody wanting to start something new with another person? Let me see. Somebody wants to date or someone's communicating with someone new, someone younger, someone more fun. Yeah. Um, somebody's keeping options open. Yeah. And keeping secrets, getting attention elsewhere. It's just like a whole bunch of hoopla and continuously doing stuff with this now person, your wife or your husband. But somebody else, either you, Leo, or the other person is keeping options open in regards to uh, meeting new people, conversing with new people, even if it's just conversation over the phone or text messaging or, or whatnot. They're getting attention elsewhere, you, Leo, or someone or the, your other person. Because it's too tumultuous, it's too drama filled, too crazy with this other person, with your wife or your husband. Um, it's like you, you guys have both decided, okay, we're going to get over this and we're going to work through our problems. And it was a breakdown in communication. Um, some of somebody got kicked out of the home or left the home or got locked up or something of that nature. And now we're coming back together and we're going to make this work is what you and the other person said. Um, But the problem is somebody's still keeping options open. Still, somebody also has a real connection or, or finds like common ground. Someone finds a, a real chemistry, a real connection, common ground with another person. So you, this other person, either you, Leo, or or is vice versa, they really have deep emotions or, or deep connection to this person. They may think about them at night, dream about them. They've suppressed these feelings to stay in a connection with maybe Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This is you, Leo, or someone else. Um, their household is upside down. Your household is upside down, Leo, or the other person's household is upside down there's not a whole bunch of commitment there's somebody in a commitment but being single in a commitment let's see what the shells say for you open open some of you is career you're going to go to a new career path you're, you're done with whatever it is you were doing um Jealousy, definitely. Somebody's jealous ways cause maybe a breakdown. Um, the last hard, something is hard. Like I said, some of you want to move past, get through, work through, rework, blah blah blah. But something is hard um, in, in to having this new beginning because something else is holding you back, or someone else is holding you back, or you have obligation with another person and you're arguing with this person a lot it may be in regards to money and or childish ways or forgetting things or just drama all together we have a new person that you're you may be in love with but you still have obligations somewhere else uh, or this is an ex-wife or ex something or something of that nature um, the advice for you is to cut out what doesn't serve you have new beginnings see see how you can service both parties and at least come to some agreement here um the outcome is eight of water eight of cups so you just want to walk away from Some relationship where there wasn't a whole bunch of commitment. Or some of you want to go back towards. 
either or. But this wasn't a committed relationship. You guys did things like you were committed or, you know, you you acted and there was a commitment to what it is you guys were doing. That's what the commitment was to. But there wasn't like, oh, we're boyfriend and girlfriend. Oh, we, you know, we met each other's parents and we did this and we did that. It was more like we're committed to having a lot of fun with each other. And someone wants to come back to that dynamic you or the other person uh, or someone is walking away from you know an, a com not committed relationship because it, it's just continuously causing a lot of drama here for someone someone moved out of the house or, so, or was asked to move out of the house and um, now they want to come back this could be you, Leo. It could be the other person. Somebody got locked up. Somebody. It's just like a whole bunch of stuff went on, happened, and then you had conversation that we're going to move forward. But somebody's still keeping options open, or someone doesn't want to really move forward. Um, Leo, if this resonates with you, like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. Go over to the website, book your own reading there, or take advantage of the text question. You can text a question to the number below. Pay for your question on your mobile device. Receive the answer to your question on your mobile device. It just makes me more accessible to you and you accessible to me. Leo, I hope that you have a fantastic week. Uh, do know that I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care, guys.